I uh, am active in that thing that's called the Special Olympics, uh, and we have a, a scholarship uh, for the academic people through the Kiwanis Club International for high school students who uh, academically show, you know, themselves in school that enable them to go on to higher education. And uh, a university in Israel, that uh, uh, Haifa University, which is a, a university that's really non-sectarian, and that uh, the funds for raising that, it's in, in behalf of the slain Israeli athletes. Just about every hotel in Mission Valley's hotel circle was jam-packed this weekend with thousands of men's clothing store buyers from all over the country attending the annual trade show of California apparel manufacturers. One of the headquarters hotels was the LeBaron, where a center of attention today was the Olympic swimming champion Mark Spitz. He autographed his photos in rooms occupied by the company featuring Mark Spitz sportswear. Spitz no longer does competitive swimming, but in addition to earning vast sums, endorsing and lending his name to products, he devotes his talents to charity. I have a Mark Spitz uh, swim center at the Cedar sinai Hospital in Beverly Hills. It uh, caters to the physically handicapped and the psychiatrically ill uh, people, not only from the Los Angeles area, but from worldwide who want to come to this institution. It's a specially designed pool for uh, the physically handicapped so that they can rehabilitate themselves. And of course, the uh, psychiatrically ill people use it for a uh, rehabilitation for group therapy where they can come and have a common interest and learn how to swim in the, in the pool. And it seems to be working out, and it's, uh, I'm very proud of it. And, of course, I've donated my time and my money to, to help uh, keep, keep the thing running. And it's uh, quite costly for uh, one year's operation and it runs about a quarter of a million dollars a year. So through, you know, proceeds that are, uh, you know, given, uh, I'm really happy to help other people. And it's... And it's to me that's exciting. It, as I'm not a coach or anything, so I that probably would answer your next question. Spitz, who is now a mature 24 years old, gained fame at 18 in the 1968 Olympics, and then cinched his millionaire status by winning seven gold medals in the 1972 Olympics, which led to sudden wealth and his present career in the business world. This is Harold Keane for TV8 Action News at the LeBaron Hotel in Mission Valley.